Autodesk Inventor has a number of productivity tools that allow you to work faster and smarter within the software. One of these items is an eye feature. An eye feature is simply a feature or sketch that you want to save as a library item that you may want to use on multiple different parts. Some of these may include like uh, sheet metal knockouts or louvers or maybe a custom hole that you use in a component frequently. After you create an eye feature, if you want to insert it, you can either do this through the insert eye feature window and navigate to the specific eye feature you want. Or if a sheet metal component, you can use the punch tool to navigate to the eye features as well. These are saved as IDE files. Now if there are certain eye features that you use frequently, you may want to access these quickly. What you can do is actually add eye features to the ribbon interface. The first thing that you should know is where these are stored. If I go to the application options, the eye feature tab, this is going to note the default location today. This can also be out on a network drive. Once you have all your eye features saved into a particular location, what you can do is customize the interface. By right clicking on one of the ribbon tabs, customize user commands, you can dig through all the different commands in the software. If you look through this list, you're going to be able to locate your eye features. All you have to do is specify the eye features that you're interested in and add those to a custom panel in a particular environment. So in this case, you notice this is the part environment, the sheet metal. Okay. If you also wanted this eye feature on additional tabs, you can go through and specify maybe the normal 3D modeling tab or maybe in the assembly environment, depending what you're trying to accomplish. Once you add all those uh, eye features, you can simply click OK. And you'll now have access to these user commands on your ribbon interface. All you have to do is specify the one that you want. It's going to access the command. You can select the placement and complete the operation. By using this, you're going to be able to access the eye features you need more quickly, making your job easier.